Hello, folks. We're live on Clicky and What's Going On Facebook group. I hope you're all well. I'm down at the all new chamber and bottle shop on, yes, Cheapside. So we're going to have a look round. But first, I'm going to have a little chat with um, the new owners, Dean. Dean and Sarah. Dean is here with me. So there we go. I'll just let you have a quick glance round. He's got the blinds down at the moment. Not open until tomorrow. Look at all that lot. Wow, it's looking great. Um, 12, 12 p.m. Is that right, Dean? 12 p.m. Yes. 12 p.m. tomorrow. Dean will be uh, in business. Dean and Sarah. And here's Dean. How are we doing, Dean? Yeah, good, thank you very much. Welcome to Clark Eaton. It's looking great. This shop is looking amazing, people. It's something different. It's not the straightforward uh, bar, and it's not a straightforward shop. It's a bit of both. They're bringing something totally new to Clack Eaton uh, and we need all to come down and celebrate this uh, venture they've got. So Dean, tell us a little bit about what it, it is that attracts you to Clack Eaton and why you've opened a business uh, in Clack Eaton, if you would. Yeah, we moved to Clack Eaton uh, a couple of years ago. Uh, had many a good night uh, around Clack Eaton. And with Sarah and I, uh, both into, uh, both into this craft ale, um, just didn't see anything like that around here, apart from obviously Mill Valley. We spent many, many of uh, our in Mill Valley and the Brew House. Um, so there's a few places in Morley, obviously Morley in a similar size town to Clackie. Right. And right. it's just growing and growing and growing as a craft ale scene in Morley. It certainly is. Mill Valley is a very popular venue. It's quirky. It's, you know, it's out of town, but it's very quirky. It's very popular. So a lot of people are excited to see you. You know, down here with the craft deals. Um, yeah, and it's so what? And I know you explained to me that um, your opening times are going to differ from bars. A little bit, yeah. We'll be open from we'll be open Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, uh, from twelve o'clock uh, in the afternoon. Um, we'll be open as a bar, but also as a, a bottle shop. So the cans in here, we can see everything. Everything's local from Yorkshire. We've got hundreds of cans. Um, and everything can be uh, taken away or, or dunk inside. And um, we've got eight lines um, as well, but we've got eight beers on uh, on tap. So we will be opening early in the afternoon, but uh, as well as that, we will be a late night bar uh, and we'll be closing at 10 o'clock. Right. Um, so, yeah, so I'm going to put you on the spot. How many people can you accommodate at one time? With social distancing, it's looking around 30 at the moment. Obviously, got to remove the bar seats. Um, once that starts to ease a bit more, we can uh, we can accommodate quite a number of uh, number of not uh, right. So. Obviously, uh, social distancing, etc., taking into account as we all know, everybody's keen on that in Clack Eaton. That's uh, so yeah. And you're planning on doing future uh, extensions, i.e., food. Um, yeah, we're doing it bit by bit. Um, so we, you know, planning and opening first, uh, and then extending to food. Again, we're trying to source everything locally. Uh, it's going to be more bar snacks, um, your pies, um, onion barges from from Bradford, some uh, some also we saw. Right. Uh, right. The idea is to try and get a number of beers to pair with those as well. Right, right. And uh, another one I'm going to put you on the spot. Can people come in for a tester? Can, we, can they have a taste of the ales? Because I mean, you've got some, uh, what, two, four, six, eight there, is it? Eight, eight, eight. Is and you've got all the cans. Uh, look at that selection, folks. Look at that selection, absolutely wonderful. I'll tell you what, we'll have, um, we'll have a look in the other room. So this, this, is, this is the main bar area. That's right, uh, and if you have a look round, there you go, guys. So when you come through the door, this is what you'll see. You'll see an happy, fat, smiling face behind the bar. That'll be, that, that's not <laughs> Dick. No. I don't think Dean smiles much as Sarah. He's still a nice guy. And as you look, which is a plus, they've got on the door, look, social distancing. It's all taken into account. And this is the other room where you can go and sit and, and, and enjoy. Uh, it's very, 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 very um minimalistic but it's it's very well done clean healthy everything is spot on but there's one thing and that i think everybody from clacky knows and loves and that's look at this wall the mr men there we go celebrating local author roger Hargreaves. 
And from talking to these guys, I do believe that, you know, that they want to bring a bit of clock heat to the bar, stroke shop. Uh, they're looking at local pictures, uh, etc. So anybody can help them pop in, have a beer and have a chat. And anybody wants to, you know, if they can help it in that, in that direction, it'd be great. So, yeah. So tomorrow, the big tomorrow. day, Dean. Yeah. What, um, 12 o'clock? 12 o'clock, we're open at 12 o'clock. Uh, we're open for walk-ins. We've got a couple of tables, uh, a couple of tables booked. If anybody wants to book, feel free. So, it's, it, 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 it's uh, bet, better to reserve if you can, reserve yeah, a ticket. Yeah, 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 but otherwise. Right, but you, you do, you're happy with people walking in. Uh, and if, if they do a short, hopefully you'll be accommodated if it's not too busy. Uh, what's all this on there? Is this your, uh, so this are, is these, are these your ales that you've... This is what we've got on tap at the moment. Right. Uh, so we've got beers from Hops and Dots. All, they're all small breweries. You can see we've got Mill Valley, can't start that Mill Valley. Mill Valley. Um, we've got a Battenberg Sour from Mr. Mr. Sipling from S43. A Sicilian Lemon Pale Ale from Anthology in Leeds. Um, Dexter's Stout from, uh, from Kirksville Brewery. A new beginning, it's 11% Imperial Stout from, uh, from Brew York. This is the other one that's not Yorkshire, but it's Raspberry Ripple Cider. That sounds really nice. nice. That sounds nice. And, um, and Stell Fox, which comes from Home Firth, just down the road. So there you go, guys. It's all, majority is locally sourced. And as I said, when I first came to visit them, there was nothing in here. There was lots to do. They put their heart and soul into it, and it's looking great. Come down tomorrow, 12 o'clock. Uh, Dean and Sarah will welcome you and welcome them to Clark Eaton. You know, and let's uh, give them the credit they deserve. Um, thanks for your time, Dean. Thank you. Thank uh, you good much. luck with tomorrow. You. We've got lots of people waving and saying hello. <laughs> so, yeah. Call in. Chamber and, bo uh, Chamber and Bottle Shop, Cheapside, Clark Eaton, tomorrow, 12 noon, opening. Come down and see him. Thanks, Dean. Thanks very much. Cheers, folks. Speak soon.